world, Prentice here again. So uh, I'd like to talk to you about something, because that's kind of what I do here. <clears throat> uh, I'm sure everyone by this point has heard about, uh, you know, Casey Anthony and what she did or did not do to her daughter and the fact that in the court of law she was found innocent. Whatever. That's not really what I want to talk about. Uh, there was a, a status message that was getting passed around Facebook. It was sort of a joke. The gist was that she was calling 911 for assistance, Casey, and um, police said they would be there in 31 days. The joke being that, you know, it took, they're saying it took her 31 days to report her daughter missing. Haha, <laughs> whatever. Uh, I thought it was funny. I mean, sometimes really, really bad things happen, and the only way to process it is with humor. Morbid humor, to be sure, but humor. And that's all it is. Uh, someone on my friends list, and I guess it's, it's not like it's a secret, so I'll say her name is Angela, uh, took issue with this. And, well, if you know Angela, you would know that she takes issue with a lot of things. Uh, I think she just has problems dealing with her anger or whatever. Uh, I sympathize, but it's kind of hard for me to feel bad for her. When she's cussing me out over things that are, to me, rather insignificant. Um, so yeah, and then there was this whole thing back and forth. and. Basically, her point was I was immature and insensitive for posting that, and I was trying not to say exactly what I thought, because, you know, two people losing their temper and acting like jackasses is not going to accomplish anything. So, I don't think we're friends anymore, which is too bad, because... In spite of everything, I still kind of like Angela. You know, she's smart and strong-willed. She's also stubborn and irrational. But, uh... Eh. If, that's how it's, if that's how she wants it to be, I guess that's how it's got to be. Anyway. Uh, just thought I'd share that little insight. I guess just one more of the, uh cuts I'm going to have to make in my life to get by. I don't know. You know what's weird about it, though, is even though I was inside, I felt upset, I was laughing. Not because I didn't take it seriously or anything, just, uh, I don't know, I just laughed. I've been laughing quite literally in the face of adversity quite a bit the last few days, and I'm starting to wonder if something might be wrong with me. But it's working for me, so... Yeah, I guess if it works, it's not bad, right? Well, I'll keep you posted about that. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and until next time, in the world. I uh, wanted to wish my cousin Raisha a happy birthday today. She's... Yeah. I forgot how old she is. <laughs> Sorry, Raisha. <laughs> anyway, uh, 